Hello world, how are you today? My name is Owen Fox and in this video is I want to share with you a tip on detoxifying. I hope you're well and lots of love to you. The most important thing in life is our spiritual growth but in this video I want to share with you how I've been detoxifying very effectively lately and how I read a post today where our cells are, can live forever but it's the environment, the interstitial cellular surrounding flu that matters most. So you want to clean out the toxins and free radicals and as Dr. Moore says, that's called your lymphatic system, basically. So detoxify and get rid of the toxins and create clean, fresh, new liquid around the cells is what's important. So lately in the last like while, my predominant diet has been mostly made out of fruits and broccoli soup. It sounds funny, but it's all wet and been detoxifying very effectively lately, especially since we've been one water enema a day. Um, a lot coming in my intestines and mixing with a bit of intermittent dry fasting overnight I'm definitely getting like crazy filtration like the best filtration ever of my entire life which is washing and cleaning that like um, it's like cleaning the water of fish tank it's like cleaning the cell, the surrounding fluids that the, the cells bathe in and live in and are surrounded in so that's essential so yeah they're the two main things you want to like clear out your intestines as they say death um, begins in the colon but what they really mean is instead of your colon is your small intestine which is the biggest one far bigger and longer than your large intestine so um it's yeah so life begins in your intestines as well so it's about the food that you eat and it's about cleaning your intestine and about cleaning your inter interstitial surrounding cellular fluid so yeah you do that by um doing either a mixture of fasting intermittent fasting it could be water fasting intermittent dry fasting or if you're more experienced a little bit longer dry fasting or longer water fasting especially um, and of course simply um, your diet so I'd highly recommend making your diet wetter so if you if it's raw like don't be like you do whatever you want to do of course I'm like, I do the same thing I do it sometimes but what I mean is if your focus is on cleansing and if you want to cleanse and you may not know about this do what I've done which is to experiment and practice having sh changing your diet a little bit so for example like cooked dry food like pizza bread and um, crackers all the sort of stuff is like really really drying and sticky and congested to your intestines and your lymphatic system especially your intestines whereas if you want to if you have similarly like dry raw food like crackers kale kale chips and uh, like raw bread from dehydrated flax seeds and carrots or uh, like raw pizza that's still like very very slow to digest complicated and dry not good <laughs> it'll dry out it'll it'll slow down your poops and it's just not good for cleaning out really at all it's good for slowing down detoxifying if that's what you need to do so that's fantastic there but overall we're not a wet we are, we're not a dry food species we're a wet food species so we're fruitarian species and even even breatharian like pranic living species we're not just like the other animals where we need solid food like like they do as much at all um so so yeah stuff like going to juice feast um multiple extended juice feasting or just do what i do like i, I it's very easy like sometimes i have um a bit more of a dryer cooked food but not usually i've really reduced it i would also two and a half months all raw um earlier on the year but i have to say like just to, there was a lot of like stuff like, like chocolate and like um a whole lot of salads with avocado and mixtures like a whole lot of recipes and salads avocado is much fattier whereas basically focusing around just wet and no like big thick heavy solid fats like not not none but like very rarely really it's much lighter it's much much lighter even though i have broccoli it's just if you ever try and clean a broccoli pot or a cauliflower pot like a starchless vegetable pot there's nothing there it's not it's totally non-stick easy to flush away and that's the exact same way as it is in your intestines so if you want to detoxify and i'm detoxifying like a king at the moment <laughs> i can see it in my my bowel movements and obviously in my pee my filtration is fantastic do what i'm doing eat wet drink wet obviously you can't drink solids but drink and eat wet and you get really good results so yes hello alan mr fruitarian king just come online yeah i won't repeat everything i said but uh, have it listen eat wet filtration clean your intestines eat the fruits and uh, live in the prana more and listen to your body and learn as you go along and see what works for you and have fun enjoying the journey hey everyone lots of love talk to you again another time hope you enjoyed the video